Okay, so this video is similar and continuing on from the previous one. Uh, we've got three linear terms, but we've got a repeated root again, because we've got x plus 2 all squared. So, um, we know that this uh, cubic must cross the x-axis at 4 or at minus 2. Okay, so it's only got two points where it crosses the x-axis. So we've got minus 2 and 4. So, then we look at, is it a positive cubic or a negative one? We would have minus x times x times x, so we've got a minus x cubed, so it's negative, so we're starting at the top left this time. So we come in from the top left, and in getting to minus 2, we're only going to touch minus 2 at one point. Then we cross the y-axis, and then back down through 4. Okay, All that we then need to do is fi figure out where is it crossing the y-axis. That would be at 4 times 2 times 2, which is 16. Okay, And that is how we would do it. So if you get a repeated root, um, so we've got two linear terms the same, then the curve is just going to touch that point once. Okay, It's not going to cross it there. Okay, so you'll get a situation like this.